Thank you, Calvin. Uh, I assure you. And that's why we've put together a very strong team so that um, these um, investigations are carried out professionally. That's why we have the given a government uh, chemist with us, very senior pathologist with us here. Um, our best investigators are here because we like to be there. Uh, therefore, the sedentary also, the DPP is part of uh, these investigations. But um, let me not go to the details. As you know, this is a matter, is a matter already before court. Many, many, many more people will go to court. Uh, allow me, with due respect, not to preempt. Um, because we are going to prefer more charges. But let's leave at that, please. Can we? Let's leave at that. With due respect. Maybe the last one? My name. Um, thank you, Mutalaki. Maybe I start with the land ownership. And um, you from the media, I think you called me this morning uh, telling me um, that a criminal with us owns uh, 800 acres here. Well, is a matter under investigations because other parties have come forward saying it does not own this parcel of land. So it's a matter again under investigations, active investigations. So the ownership of this parcel of land is in dispute. I stop at that. Um, regarding the deaths which has have happened, and this is what I would like to caution our, our people. Um, yeah, we are saying let's spread uh, uh, the gospel. I'm a believer, I'm a Christian. The this year I will tell you is a Muslim. So we have no issues with, we are not saying the gospel according to the Bible, according to the uh, Quran. Let's, let's, let's spread the gospel. But the good part of the religion, right? But where you tell people, join my church, don't eat, don't take water, don't take anything. My, I believe all of them went to Sunday school, went to those uh, early, early classes, eh, whether a Muslim or a Christian. Where, what, how does somebody tell you not, not, not to eat? You see yourself dying, your colleague dying, you are losing weight, but this person telling you not to eat is adding weight. Therefore, I think let's, let's start by not pointing fingers. When this situation, can we maybe sensitize our people, right? Let's, let's tell our people, please be careful with these religious beliefs. Extremism, radicalism, all these bodies we have exhumed here, who post-mortem will be done. We are also collecting samples from the graves. And you've seen mass graves. We are collecting samples. Those who, who, who go, those small samples, who go through various tests, want to um, identify whether there was any poisoning, also, out of the postmortem, we shall be able to, to tell how did this person die. Was he, was there suffocation? Was any other method used? Was murder committed? So, in-depth investigations will be carried out. And I've stated, anybody found culpable for whatever offense will carry his own cross. So far, so far, so far, um, up to this moment, by yesterday for the same. Today we have exhumed 
they are just about to remove uh, 11 other bodies. This is continuous operation. And you know, we've talked about the rescuing. You know, this, this is expansive part of land. So actually we are, in two, we are in two teams. There are those exhuming and another team out there rescuing those who could be alive. And that's why I remember I started by telling you you have already rescued 29. It's ongoing operation. Doing carrying out the exhumations, then rescuing those who could be alive. Maybe that's what we did. Yes, we believe they are, we believe they are more sites. We, that's that's we believe they are more sites, and that's why I I, I like to thank the officers and the teams here. Uh, the, the patriotism, the commitment I've seen in them uh, is is indeed encouraging. So we are, we are we are ready to go all the way until we rescue any person who could be out there starving himself because he was told by this person criminal. To, to starve himself or herself. So effort will be put to rescue everybody here and also uh, exhume up to the last point. Okay. Now as National Police Service, and this year I will tell you, we are doing there's something we shall have to do, DNA.